starts a strong finish from hosts Weathersfield Raiders saw them secure an overall draw in their Braintree Open Darts League game against the Angel. The Angel had take the early initiative with a win in the latest competition followed by a 2-1 win in the pairs and a draw in the triples and they held a commanding match lead going into the singles. Colin Thompson extended the Angels' advantage with a 2-1 win over Phil Hume in the opener but with the Raiders winning five of the remaining games they had the singles won with the overall match ending in a draw. The Swiss Bells and Farmer on Deb Webb got their team off to a good start with a win in the ladies over visiting Bocking Club. The Swiss followed that up with a 3-0 win in the pairs before the teams played out a draw in the triples, however Bocking's hopes for a comeback were short-lived. The Swiss claimed all seven singles they had that competition and the match points were secured. Notley Sports were hosts to Crescent A and, with Tracy Hayden and Josie Patterson chalking up a win in the ladies, the visitors were off to a solid start. Notley came back with a 2-1 win in the pairs but with Cressing winning the triples they had the match advantage going into the singles. Ryan Wills extended Cressing's advantage with a 2-1 win over Dave Islip in the opener but Graham Chinnery's 2-1 win over Sam Lepley in the second gave Notley a lifeline. However, that was to be the last win for Notley as Cressing took all the remaining games to secure the singles and match points. The Eagle Bees match against Weathersfield Club started with a draw in the ladies followed by a 2-1 pairs win for the Eagle and a draw in the triples to give a slight match advantage to the home team going into the singles. Weathersfield's Bill Knightwood's 2-1 win over Richard Chandler in the first game leveled the match and with Weathersfield winning five of the remaining games, they had the single in match one. Braintree Football Club's Kelly Powell and Don Kennedy got their team off to a good start in the match against the Eagle A with a win in the pairs. The football club followed that up with a 2-1 win in the pairs before the teams played out a draw in the triples. The singles saw the first four games go the football club's way to give them the singles points and overall match win. Tim Franklin hit two 180s while Andy Smith hit one and Tracy Hayden hit a 73-out shot.